check me out i have ripped that bitch no because i'm not recording this shit again it's literally three o'clock in the morning and i'm having a fucking download and you need to hear it if you've been struggling with trying to like level up and you know get to the next level whether it be in your personal or in your business life your professional life i just i just cracked the fucking code like i just like i just cracked that bitch say it with me y'all self awareness holy shit <laughs> it's you it's you it's you you're the problem you're the solution you're like everything rolled up into one and you, i know you can't fathom that but as of right now you have no choice because you know things are probably shit's hitting the fan shit's hitting the fan at this point and now you're coming to this realization of nobody's coming to help me you know why you know why princess fiona because you were prince charming the whole fucking time now let's talk about you having this lack of self-awareness, right? Let's just talk about it. Let's just get into it. Let's talk about it. And baby, if the shoe fits, lace that hoe up. Signs that you're probably lacking some self-awareness. Procrastination. It's really hard for you to focus. Irritability. Misunderstandings. Burnout. Anxiety. And literally just an overall decline to your whole personal and professional life like it's just everything just shit's hitting the fan everything's going to shit but let's talk about how you could fix that with your mind now there's two types of minds that i typically like to talk about or in this case mindsets that i like to talk about this being a growth mindset and a fixed mindset now people with a growth mindset such as myself these are typically people that believe that anything can be done through dedication. Like as long as you are dedicated, as long as you are focused on the mission, on the vision, it has no choice but to happen. So in that case, whenever they run into challenges such as me in the beginning of this fucking video and I couldn't get English out, like they see that as a chance to grow and an opportunity to learn something new about themselves and, you know, let the old shit go that wasn't working for them. They just tend to be very resilient and very open. Like they don't let challenges stop them from doing shit they wanna do. And they're always open to new people, new opportunities, new strategies, new solutions, just new, new shit. Somebody with a fixed mindset, and as I've said before, if the shoe fucking fits, bitch, okay? These are people that just usually tend to be like, you know, things are the way they are. I can't change that. I can't change how smart I am. I can't change how I look. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I may put a little bit of makeup on, but that's not going to change the fact that I'm ugly, you know, or that, that nobody wants me. <laughs> but these are people that tend to look for instant gratification. So let's just say, let's just use that example. You know, nobody wants me. That new lace front wig is not going to make you any more beautiful. I, I can guarantee you that I, mm. <laughs> but I know you're like Brianna. Okay, come on. How does this, how does this pertain to me? Like, what is this information going to do to me? How the fuck does this relate to what the fuck I got going on right now? Self-awareness is kind of like your own personal GPS, not kind of like it actually is. We all know a GPS helps you understand your current location, where you currently are, but it also guides you to your desired destination. Self-awareness is quite literally your own personal GPS. By you establishing self-awareness, it helps you understand where you are mentally, physically, spiritually, if you're into that. But it also guides you to like that dream life that you've always wanted to live. But if you've noticed, you you are the thing that has been holding you back this entire time you know i mean whether you notice it or not by watching this video i just wanted to tell you that from personal experience <laughs> for example when you become more self-aware when you start to understand where you are mentally physically and spiritually if you're into that this makes it a lot easier to manage things like stress and anxiety by being self-aware, you can make more aligned and conscious decisions that are, you know, pushing you towards that goal that you want to reach. Instead of focusing on your problems, this helps you create more solutions. You know, instead of you focusing on this problem, this problem, uh, this bill is not getting paid, these teammates aren't doing what they're supposed to be doing, da, 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 da. It helps you become more aware of the situation, become more aware of what you could do about the situation, and then you just end up fucking doing it. And self-awareness could even help you with things like your relationships and your communication skills. 
and I'm not even just talking about like romantic relationships. I mean like partnerships, teammates, co-founders, co-workers, like literally anybody. When you become more self-aware, it helps you better understand other people, okay? So by becoming more self-aware in your relationships, in your communication, this leads to better genuine interactions. This leads to more effective communication skills and just an overall better way of resolving conflicts between people, just people. By establishing a sense of self-awareness, it helps you to realize, understand, and really know who the fuck you are without needing somebody's permission or needing validation from anybody or anything, really, especially things like money, okay? So if you were actually ready to, I don't know, go on this whole self-awareness journey and level up your personal life and your business, I got something for your ass, I do. Hold on, because I get really excited when I talk about this. Okay, me and my best friends have literally created an entire university just for entrepreneurs. And yes, I am a college dropout who started her own fucking college. <laughs> but we literally go over every single thing it takes to create a successful business. Everything from self-mastery, which is basically a glimpse of what I just gave you, but it kind of tied into business aspects, right? We have self-mastery, we have branding and marketing, we have business production and sales, and we also have business and family optimization, like just to be able to actually give you that sense of freedom that you've really been looking for like your entire life. But this is a university, so it's not like a master course, it's not like an ebook, it's not any of that shit. Like this is a live interactive community. It's so active. Everybody's so loving and so supportive. If you haven't checked out the testimonial that I just posted not too long ago, literally go listen to her testimony. That is a real student with a real testimony from our real university. <laughs> Not only has she seen an increase in her business, she's seen an increase in her personal life. She sees an increase in her self-confidence, in her self-concept, in her self-awareness, because it's all about you, baby. Self, self, self. So if you were ready to join us over there, then you can head to the link in my bio and fill out your application so we can look over that and get you enrolled before classes start again next week and you got to get caught up. You are ready to level up, like go to the absolute next level, go to some unfathomable shit, some shit that you've never seen in your life, but you've always dreamed of. It's time for you to get to class. It's time for you to fill out that application. What are you doing? You're not too late. <sighs> okay, love you, bye.